Next, I'm going to introduce someone you already know very well. Without her, we will never ever be able to put up a production like this. It's our dear Mrs. Yu. She has been with us since day one, 10 years ago. And she not only teach our kids music, but also teach them um, important work ethic. And she has been working with them very patiently, as I can see. As parents, you can all see this. It's not easy to put together all these kids with different levels and have such wonderful production and performance. We thank you very, very much. A few recognition. Um, these people are very, uh, instrumental in this year's production. First, we want to thank um, uh, the two people who worked with media, publicity, and outreach. And um, they are Agatha Chin and Arthur Peng. Arthur is, I guess I have been with us, you know her. And Arthur, long time uh, parent, that of uh, our drummer. Julia, awesome. Julia from already graduated. Yes, yeah, and uh, one daughter graduated. Um, you want to come over? Do we have? Oh, no, oh, no. Let me go. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, just a boss. Yeah, I'm right. Next, we have uh, Kenny and Sarah to thank for, we know that uh, they loaned us their wonderful warehouse week after week and uh, we burden them so much and we really really want to thank you. Yeah. And next, okay, you probably know other than Mrs. Yu, we have Miss, Mrs. Liu, Tina Liu. She is a piano teacher and all the music. We need her to, we have her, uh, we have her help to transpose and put together all the music she and uh, it's a very difficult job. So we want to thank Tina, please. Our concert master, the mother of our concert master. And next, uh, well, Jonathan, same thing. Um, he is a genius, transposing a lot of music. All these different pieces. I can I hear you? next is anyway, please stand up. She likes to do movies and films, so you see the short film of 10 year anniversary is her work with some help of uh, Teresa. So we thank her. Uh, yeah, the singers. Where are our little kids? They're out here. Our little ones, please. They are probably hungry and getting some food. We have, we have something for them. They are so cute, don't you think? Oh yeah. Okay, please. Yeah, just yeah. We'll take a picture of you, please. Just one more time. I'll just announce their name is Morgan Chang, Angela Wang, Lydia Lin, Kristen Kui, uh, Lin Shu, Megan Lim, Nathaniel Lim, and Nicholas Lim. <coughs> Friday evening at uh, Pomona Senior Center, and they also came to stay for us. So, and the seniors were so grateful. They were very happy. Is this 
um, is a special thank, thanks for uh, Zachary Yu, yeah. Ezekiel Yu, and Ria Lin. I'm sure by the last name you know whose sons these two are. Please stand up. Zachary and Ezekiel, Ezekiel the two handsome men, and Ria in the back. She just returned. She, she told me she came back from, uh, she came from airport directly just now to help us. So we thank her. Now, I'm going to give the floor to um, Tammy and Agatha, our souls of the souls of our great organization, WRCM. Dear guests, friends of World Vision and WRCM, and uh, WRCM uh, members and uh, parents, Good afternoon. Thank you for coming this afternoon. It's a very touching moment for me. Uh, I can't express how grateful I am uh, to see so many of you to join uh, joining us for this uh, big milestone for the uh, Maya milestone event for the WRCM. WRCM is an unique young musician group since 2001, and uh, it was funded uh, 2000, since 2001 was less than 20 young musicians as they send holiday music and joys to the senior centers, uh, local senior centers and then expanded to uh, include a fundraising event mission in 2006. To be honest, it's been quite a challenge to keep this group alive and lively for the past 10 long years. The teamwork and dedication and the commitment among members and parents are the key in laying the solid foundation for the success of the WRCM. WRCM's mission is kids helping kids and healing through music for those kids who have suffered from natural disaster to restore their lives. From the fundraising preparation and creation of a website, WRCM members have learned not only how to be a team player, and but also cultivate leadership skills. WRCM has become one big family over the past 10 years. Huge thanks to the dedication and support from Mrs. Jo Yu, the conductor, and Agatha, Agatha Chin, my classmate <coughs> from high school. So you know how long we have been friends together. And also, uh, our special guest and long-term friend, Miss and Mrs. Uh, Mr. and Mrs. James uh, Sanchez. And also, Ms. Star Young, who is our liaison this year from Washington. And the most important are you, the loyal and our friends and families of WRCM, our audience, yeah, for making WRCM success. Thank you so much for all of your great support. I really appreciate it. And now I would like to you know, uh, invite a few uh, special guests
come to uh, say a few words for the 10 years celebration. First, that was my long-term friend, Agatha Chin. I was uh, a little worried Tammy is going to reveal our age. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, we've been knowing each other uh, many, for many, many years. Uh, about seven years ago, Colin and I joined this organization. Uh, we had so many beautiful memories. Um, to all the members, um, I, uh, you know, I hope um, you not only you learn to make friends here, but also uh, you're inspired to uh, uh, be more compassionate on others, on others and also, uh, you know, look, those are all your friends for your for your lifelong friends. And I know you guys are on, on Facebook, right? Are you guys all, all on Facebook? I hope uh, you go that way and keep, uh, you know, like uh, communicate with each other. Um, there are many kids uh, here, they are in college already. And, um, and every time when I see so many kids come back and with the parents and I, I just can't help. I just have tears in my eyes. And I really, really appreciate everybody's support, especially the hard work from the kids. Thank you. I also want to you know, show some appreciation to our member board and parents board. This is how our teamwork is. Yeah. We have a little a diagram to show parents, how parents and members work together. <coughs> you know. Uh, the top is uh, we form a parents' board, and then along with the parents and uh, members' board, and work together. The, um, uh, the yellow is uh, the um, the color in blue. That's the job description, you know, job titles, and um, then follow with the uh, the yellow one. That's our parents. Okay, parents. And then the then the pink one. Oh, the pink one is our the pink one is our member member. So this is how I we function as a team. So teamwork is very important, and also the commitment. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you all of you. I love you. and all the wonderful, wonderful young people and um, parents and thank you so much like uh, I start participating in this concert from last year and previously in this event just um, to be a liaison between the WRCM and World Vision and um, you guys are such an inspiration seriously like I don't remember what I was doing at <laughs> your age but I I, I think this is such a, uh, you know, internally at the World Vision Office, we really thank for all your efforts. And um, I think we actually internally, this time because you guys have the P2P, the peer-to-peer -to -peer on the page, so our um, headquarters, World Vision US in federal, actually asked me, like, where is this WRCM group? Like, they are the, this month's top fundraiser uh, online. So really, um, all your efforts and the music and uh, every money, every like you know, his, the, 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 the money and the, the dollars you fundraise is really helping the children. And I love the concept that you RCM is about children helping children. So uh, thank you for your loving heart and the efforts to help the victims, especially the children in Nepal. Uh, currently, we already help. Um, for World Vision's efforts, we have already helped around like 357,000 people, and we commit to continue to help them until uh, we, our current plan is to the end of 2018. Uh, your donation and your efforts are helping them to go through recovery, like the, the, the recovery stage, this is stage two, and in 2017, we'll get into uh, training them to start rebuild their life. So thank you so much, and I want to present this uh, 
and thank you, um, the, the future friends. Thank um, your organization and your your love here. I'd like to ask Jonathan and Phoebe to come and sit down and talk Say, um, we have a, like, just a table to have the information about World Vision over there. So welcome to know us more. And there are some children waiting for help. Like um, one girl, like in her birthday is December 24th. So if you want to, just uh, come to talk to our volunteer there. Thank you. I also want to thank, uh, thanks, um, you know, World Vision team, the back side, you know. This year, their beautiful daughter also joined us. She is a wonderful singer. Uh, yeah, I just recently I just retired from World Vision after almost 24 years. I've been involved uh, working for the poor and with the poor and as an advocate for the poor for the past four or five years. And uh, it's been a big change for me. For all of, for those of you who have not yet retired, whoo, boy, it can be uh, an experience. Uh, for me, I've, I've worked every day of my life since I was seven and a half years old. I grew up in a poor family, but growing up poor did not uh, uh, it gave me an opportunity to learn some real good lessons. I have two wonderful parents, one of them who's still alive today. Uh, she's 93. Uh, two months ago, uh, she fell and broke her hip. So she's still in a very difficult situation. But through my mom and my father, as poor as we were, they taught us at a very young age to never, ever forget the poor. And I can tell you, I can go on for an hour and tell you stories of how they demonstrated to me growing up. To never forget the poor. And I uh, thank God for the opportunity for guiding my life to, to do things, to uh, reach out, and to care for the poor. As I've been spending this time making these adjustments, thinking about what else I'm going to be doing in my uh, years going forward, I've had plenty of time to think back of all the people that I've met, all the things that I've, that I've experienced, all the many places in the world that I've had the opportunity to go visit. And you see this smile on this face? That is the feeling I get when I think about World TV Chamber Music. I, I, I see a lot of familiar faces that I've had a chance to know over the past years. You are symbolic. You are symbolic of everything that is good in this world. You parents, you remind me of my parents who instilled in me the importance of as we grow up and we become successful and meaningful in our lives, in society, you are instilling what my parents instilled in me to never forget the poor. And for you, I give my hand up to you. We got here a little bit late. We had to stop over to see my mom. She's uh, partially bedridden now because of that broken hip. And she is the most amazing person. She has a very cheerful, positive attitude towards life. She's always been that way. And so when I, when I, uh, when I saw her, uh, she asked me to go to the other room because she had a stack of letters that she wanted me to read to her. So I took her the letters. 
And the letters were all letters from different organizations, like the World Vision, that were asking for donations. And as sick as my mom is, at 93 years of age, still to her this day, that's important to her. And for her to continuously demonstrate to me the importance of living life to its fullest, and with a very positive attitude that she has, helps me at this time in my life to look forward to life in a very positive way. And so I want to say thank you. Thank you very much, Tammy, for having us here. And I have to also say that I would not have been the person I am and do all the wonderful things I've done in my life without the support of my wife. Because she had to be without me for many evenings, weekends, when I travel abroad, she's always very supportive and took care of home. And I'm very proud of my daughter. Um, we have fun with each other. I graduated from USC. She graduated from UCLA. So we have fun. But I'm very proud of you. And I want to thank you very much. God bless you all. And keep up the good work, all of you. Thank you for coming. and make sure everything is, you know, like uh, back in the original shape and they leave after us. So we have to, you know, show our appreciation. Thank you. We also have some gifts for Johnny and Drew. So they are not here, but we want to show appreciation to the help us. Happy birthday, Happy birthday. Yeah. One, two, three. Yeah.